And welcome back. This is Baldur's Good with another episode of Let's Play Xenogears. I am here outside the town of Lehan on the world map. Uh, you just go out any random direction of the town except for north, and you'll end up here. And I am going to get into a battle for you guys. Battles are always in forests. Don't you learn anything from RPGs? And here we find one of the best battling systems of any game I've, I think I've ever played. Okay, so you have four options here. Attack, Chi, uh, Defense, Item. And then... You can also do Escape, Combo, and Item again. Uh, combo I can't do anything with yet. Chi, um, I can do a Guided Shot, but I don't feel like doing it against this enemy. Right now, I'm going to attack. And then when uh, you can attack, you get three options. You get the, the Weak, uh, the Strong, and the Fierce. I will be always 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 doing weak to start off and you'll see why eventually yeah this guy this guy's not an easy guy all right and you do little combos against your opponent and hopefully he'll go down this time no he's still alive this guy is not a pushover it's pretty much, it's still a turn-based attacker. There he goes. Uh, it's not an action-based, but it does have action elements to it, which is always nice. I get eight experience for that, and I get fencing wear. No gold, though, but that fencing wear should prove handy for me. Let's see if I can equip it yet. Let's take a look at that. Equip. I don't have a weapon yet, no, but I do have martial wear. But fencing wear is better, so already we're getting better. Let's try to find another enemy. Actually, hold on. Let me show you guys the death blows here. Um, okay, so you can look at his skills. He's got death blows, which you can't see anything in yet. Yeah, nothing. And then you can see the abilities from there, and it's a ball of chi attack, and then you can equip from there as well. Uh, death blows, since apparently they don't feel like showing them to you, death blows are basically combo attacks that you can do uh, once you have learned them. But it does take a while to learn them. The easiest way to learn all the death blows is just to spam the triangle button when you attack. Here we go. Here's some enemies I want to show you guys. Let's go ahead and show off the guided shot on this guy. And oh, it does kill him. Nice. But to be fair, these guys suck. And they die when I do a regular attack too. So I get four experience for that. Uh, no items, no gold. I'm gonna be leveling up out here while my bed is still free. And I'll probably level up to level three and I'll meet you guys back inside Lehan. Be right back. And what do we have here? We have new enemies. This is a little kobold. That's, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. And uh, nothing particularly fantastic about these guys. They, uh, they hit you. And then sometimes they launch bomb arrows. But they are new enemies here outside the town of Lehan. They go down in two turns, which is fine. They shoot arrows right at your hip, which is exactly where all the archers tell you to aim. Aim for the hip. Oh, took him down for one try that time. I am up to level three now. Sometimes they will drop fencing caps, though, which is something that I do have equipped. But there you go, new enemy, all the enemies in this area. I'll meet you back when we go north to Satan's place. Be right back. Okay, we're at the northernmost point of Lehan Village, and it says it right there. Mountain path ahead. Beware of the HP gobbling hobgobs. They actually sometimes drop stuff too, so whatevs. Okay, what I have brought with me now is... Well, I sold the eyeball because it was worth a hell of a lot of money. I kept the mermaid here. I have no idea what it's for. Uh, I have ten omega souls, five aqua souls, an aqua soul S, and I got five hob jerkies along the way battling it. Or stores, I believe, the same amount. Yeah, same same amount as the aqua soul, but it cannot be used in battle. That's the only downside to it. Otherwise, it's pretty much the same as an aqua soul. So let's go forward. 
And we're heading towards Satan, that dude that was yelling at us in the little cutscene. Yeah. So we do have the, the save point right here. Let's go ahead and use that. You just press X to, uh, to activate that. Go ahead and save it. This does take a while, yeah. I do have some old, old saves on here. I don't even know how old they are. They must be about a year old at, at the very least. Yeah, I don't know what that is, actually. Okay. Overriding that. No need to use that anymore. I was only level 6 anyways. That's a stupid level, level 6. Alright, we're all finished here. That's the last time you'll be seeing that. But first, I want to go to the right here. And we do have battles along the mountain path. And what do we have here? Well, what's that? It's a jackal! It's a jackal! Jackal? Jackal! It's a jackal! Yeah, it's a jackal. Yeah, see, look, they can't actually move. And then usually I can just get them off in two hits and that'll be enough to kill them. Yes! Oh no, he actually hit me. For one damage, whatever shall I do? Yeah, why not just use all of them? I can't use the AP anyway, so there's no point in building me up. Uh, if you cancel the attack uh, by pressing the circle button, before you uh, before you finish your turn, it'll start building up AP, but of course that really doesn't do anything for you. But we do get two hob jerkies. Uh, it doesn't do anything for me right now because I don't have any moves that use AP. So, there's that. Yeah, let's move this camera around. There it is. Jump. Yeah. That would be the wrong button. They, they have the map. It all mapped out weird. I keep on thinking I'm going to change it. Damn it! Is it? No, it's just, it's the same exact fight. Good lord. Yeah, the, the jump button's on the triangle button. That's weird. And you also know something in the game that um, you can continue walking even though the battle is still loading. So uh, you'll stop doing stuff all of a sudden and it's because there's going to be a battle. Okay, so we go back past the save point. We probably don't have to do that, but this is the way I like to go continue going north and then we can see the rest of the little area here it's not big at all Doc Uzuki's Sedan Uzuki that that's a proper Japanese name Sedan Uzuki what's up little kid the cliff's edge collapsed from the heavy rain we had recently here are you can do a big jump I'm scared it did What's a big jump? How could you forget? Pressing the triangle button while running with the circle button head down. You can jump much farther than we go to jump, really. It's a run jump. Why, why don't you call it a run jump? But I want... I want... Hmm. I swore it was this one. Maybe it's this one here. Yeah, I think it's this one here, is it? I think, yeah, I found a bird nest. Take the egg! No! Crap! No! <laughs> Get away! No! No! Stop it! No, it's my egg! Oh, he took an HP off of me. Bastard. Just because I stole your kid is no reason to start doing like this. No. And don't do that while I'm trying to do my big jump. Yeah, I just made it. Damn it! And after that battle, I really did need to use a hob jerky. No! It's my freaking egg! Stop it! Uh, because they, the hobgobs, also have this attack where they do uh, use HP absorb of sorts. And I get an Um And it does a hell of a lot more damage than everything else. No! Mine. Did you see that spider? I want the spider. Give me the spider. No! No! I lost the egg after all that! Ugh. I want the spider. Give me the spider. Damn it, I lost the egg. <laughs> I lost the egg, you guys. I'm sorry. How do I get the spider? Hold on for a second. No, it just says I jumped. There we go. I caught the spider. Now I have to go back for the egg. 
Our epic quest begins now! That's my egg! I need it! We have to get it, you guys. It's very important. Why? Shut up, that's why. Damn it! You, yeah, you made me fall off because of that, didn't you? Oh, I hate you. Okay, so let's go up this way. Then we can make it back down here. And then jump. Oh, I can't get it back? No! Well, you guys, uh, how it's done. Uh, once you make it off the screen, then you can keep the egg. Lame. Well, let me have it back. But you guys saw how to do it. So I'm sorry. <laughs> it's not 100% run anymore. Oh, you suck again. I am trying for a 100% run, but I've already failed, and I pretty much figured I'd fail throughout the entire thing. But I'm going to get as close as I can. At least you guys know how to get it. That's the important thing. So, uh, where am I? There we go. And that was it. That was as far as I needed to go. But instead, I said, fine, you can have your freaking bird egg, bird egg back. Is this his house? Damn, that's a nice house, dude. It's all moonshiny. I'm sorry, he's got a still in there somewhere. You know what I mean? He's got, he's got something working in here. Okay. So, first things first, I believe it's here? No. What's up, chicken? That is the craziest sounding chicken I've ever heard in my life. Wait. What's that? I found some bird seed. Why did you eat it? I did not... That's not what I wanted you to do. That's not cool. Let's see, where's... Where's the staircase? There it is. Right at the beginning. Of course it is. And then the birds all fly away! What's in here? What do we got? Oh. Okay. Oh, come on, that's a treasure chest. You won't let me open it? Can I sleep in his bed? Uh, you and your manners, bae. The hell? And I found an aquasol. Sweet chicken was had a potion on him for whatever reason. Okay. Um. Okay. Very, very interesting. Kind of hard to see the flat, the flat ladder there in the middle. Whatever. Do you want to look through the telescope? Hells yeah! What kind of constellation can I see? Do I have to... How do I make the dot so I can get the power up? Oh, okay, there's no constellation.